Well, the community is coming together and sharing beloved memories after a favorite tree was cut down this week. The tree is more than 100 years old, and WSAB's Tara Nicole joining us live from Macaulay Park with the effort to give the tree a new life. That's right, Ben and Tina. I am here in Macaulay Park, and right here you can actually see the century-year-old tree where it used to stand. Now, the rest of the tree was hauled off this morning by the city of Savannah, and they took it to an organization called Repurpose Savannah. But before we get into that, I just want to know all of the candles and the flowers. There was actually a memorial service held here this Sunday, or last Sunday, excuse me, for this tree because a lot of people in the community say, it's just a beloved part of their community. We had kids telling us today that they grew up with this tree from pre-K, climbing on it, falling out of it. So it's definitely going to be missed. But the good news is the tree is going to come back in a new way. They're going to be repurposing it at the organization I spoke to earlier today that is called Repurpose Savannah. So they are going to be taking that tree and turning it into park benches for McCulley Park. And their whole mission is to stop buildable materials from going into the landfill, whether that trees or houses. They're worth saving. They're made of really beautiful material um, and preserving them allows for the memory of the tree to live on. This is the second tree from McCulley Park that Kelly and her team will be salvaging. She says just like humans, trees also have a lifespan. Live oaks are really amazing trees, but structurally, uh, you know, they have things that happen to them throughout their lifetime that can cause their demise. Um, this one actually had what looked like a broken heart. The tree is going to be repurposed and put back in the park, but Kelly says if you have fond memories and want a piece of the oak in your home, some pieces will be up for sale to the public as well. We will be milling them into usable lumber that will then um, be used as park benches for Macaulay Park and then made available to the community for sale. Repurpose Savannah says if you have a project requiring lumber, come shop sustainable first. Get lumber sustainably and using reclaimed building materials is definitely one of them. I mean, it's here. We should use it. We shouldn't be throwing it away. Now, like we said earlier, trees are not the only thing that repurposed Savannah will take a hold of. If you have a house that was built before the 1950s and you're thinking about maybe demolishing it, they ask that you give them a call so they can turn that house into reusable, buildable lumber. And when we come back at six, we're actually going to talk to a student who had differing opinions about the tree. Now we've had everybody has said they loved it, but some people say that they feel like the community is making a really big deal over this tree and they don't think it's that serious. So we'll hear from that side coming up at six. Reporting live in McCulley Park, Tyler Nicole, WSAV News 3 on your side.